you. Standing up against hate hundreds of people jammed into the Purdue Student Union tonight to protest a conservative commentator's speech. News 8's Adam Pinsker is there live and joins us uh, with more. Adam, some people say this speaker has made inflammatory remarks against the LGBTQ plus community. Yeah, Phil, he sure has. Um, in fact, uh, many people were out here to protest his presence, as were many people inside the auditorium listening to Michael Knowles. He's a conservative commentator for the Daily Wire website. He was invited by the Purdue College Republicans. He did a speech. He took some Q&A, but he really come under fire for uh, calling for the eradication of transgenderism. Folks that were gathered out here to protest his visit tonight were not happy. To love your friends, irrespective of their queerness and identities. Ben O'Brien was among the hundreds who braved a chilly spring evening to protest a speech by Michael Knowles. It's really good and really affirming to see how many people are coming out here to support our trans community um, and to uh, show solidarity um, and to basically protest the administration. We need a lot of numbers to show the administration that we're pissed off with how they're spending our tuition dollars. News 8 obtained a letter saying that the Young America Foundation would sue Purdue if it blocked Knowles' speech. The university told News 8 external speakers do not represent its viewpoints. At the end of the day, the only free speech that the university actually cares about is going to be the kind of uh, conservative, sex-negative, anti-queer free speech. Someone wearing a MAGA hat got the protesters riled up, but Ethan Lover, who attended the speech, said he did not know what Knowles was going to say ahead of time, but he is looking forward to the speech. As a Catholic and as a conservative, there's not a particular topic I think he needs to address, uh, but I am just excited to hear, yes, whatever he feels uh, needs to be a main point of, of his speech today. And I did catch up with that gentleman who walked out of the speech as it finished about a half hour ago. And he said uh, that Knowles told the crowd that this country will only succeed if various ideologies can coexist. Adam Pinsker, Wish TV, WishTV.com, and like us on Facebook.